first thing you need to do is download the IDE from the official source. Uh, choose any option that is available for, for your local device, your local computer, and the downloading process will start. Unzip the file and uh, open the preview. So you'll be prompted to get the tools that the IDE needs for running your local device. In my case, I won't be required to download many things because I already got the latest version of Android Studio, the latest stable version of Android Studio in my computer. So it will be a matter of a few items for this, uh, for this preview. So it's a, as you know, it's a straightforward um, installation, just next, next, you need to accept sometimes few licenses. Once you complete the downloading process, then uh, you need to open a new project or create a new one. And then you need to again access accept the license for uh, Android uh, for, for Studio Bot. Um, the good thing about Studio Bot is you'll be able to make questions or ask questions about um, your current code. Uh, so the answers will be based on your current code. So no, it won't be a matter of a theoretical answer. It won't be based on your code and how it acts. Um, the questions or the or whatever you need to find out in your code. So this is similar to like uh, GitHub Chat. If you ever used GitHub Chat before, this is pretty much the same. It won't give you a hundred percent accurate answer as it says the, at the bottom of the screen, but it, it's a good tool that I encourage you to start taking a look of it because this is present and future of of a excellent tool I think an honest outstanding tool so that will be it enjoy it and thank you for watching